Hello everyone, welcome to another question and answer session. That the question, a 34 years old man is being examined in the pre-operative assessment in the clinic. A murmur is identified in the fourth intercostal space just to the left side of the sternum, from where it most likely to have originated. So, from this person, a 34 years old man is being examined in the pre-operative assessment clinic. Marmar is identified in the fourth intercostal space and it is on the left side of the sternum from where it most likely have to be originated. So, we have to find out the marmar arising from which of the valve. Here are the options. Options are mitral valve aortic valve, pulmonary valve, right ventricular aneurysm and tricuspid valve. So we have to find out the location of the murmur in case of auscultation of the heart and pericardium area. So now get the picture here. Here we can see this is the auscultatory area for the heart. And first of all, we can see this is the auscultative area of the mitral area. So, in case of mitral area, we auscultate the mitral area in the left fifth intercostal space. And here, this point is important that the only one aortic area present on the right side and left wall, the marmar area on the left side. So, first of all, let's see the right sided marmar area. This is the aortic area, it is the second intercostal space so this point is important that the aortic area the aortic area its asculptative body area is the second intercostal space but it is the right and it is the only right sided auscultatory sound of the heart valve then here we can see this is the pulmonary area and pulmonary area it is also the second intercostal space but it is just on the lateral side or left side of the sternum. Then third, we can see this is the tricuspid area and this tricuspid area, it is also on the left side. Uh, typically, we think that the tricuspid area, it is located on the right side, but it is not true in case of tricuspid area because the tri tricuspid area, the auscultatory area in the left side and it is in the left fourth intercostal space on the other hand you can see this is the mitral area this mitral area the oscillatory sound is located at the fifth intercostal space so mitral area fifth intercostal space tricuspid area it is fourth intercostal space pulmonary area second intercostal space and this three oscillatory area are located at the left side of the sternum on the other hand we can see the aortic area in these only auscultatory area located on the right side and the rest three are located in the left side so here we can see the pulmonary area tricuspid area and mitral area they are located in the left side so this point is very very important these three auscultatory area are located in the left side on the other hand only the aortic area this auscultatory area located in the right side but we have to remember that the auscultatory area and normal anatomical location of the heart valve are not the same location they are the different location now see the anatomical location of the heart valve it is the auscultatory area so auscultatory area area is completed that the mitral area it is fifth intercostal space tricuspid it is fourth intercostal space pulmonary second intercostal space and they are in the left side and the right side only the aortic area it is second intercostal spaces so here in this picture we can see in this rounded this rounded is the normal anatomical location of the heart valve uh, not auscultatory area here we can see the aortic area it is the only right side and rest of all we can see the pulmonary area it is second mitral area it is fifth and tricuspid area it is fourth and this tree this is on the left side 
and here we can see the outtake area it is located in the right side and in this picture we also can see this is the different heart valve here this are the heart valve here this is the pulmonary here out the tricuspid and mitral and we can see the wall heart valve are anatomically located just behind the sternum so this point is very important that the wall anatomical location of the heart valve these are the heart valve which is anatomically located and these are located just behind the sternum now we can see this is the pulmonary heart valve we have the aortic heart valve we have the tricuspid and mitral heart valve so we have to find out and we have to remember also the normal anatomical location of the heart valve because it is also very very important to answer the question because some of the question are relating to the normal anatomical location of this valve so here we can see the aortic valve the aortic valve it lies the third intercostal space here we can see the aortic valve it is from the third intercostal space and then we can see the mitral valve it is the fourth intercostal space and we can see the tricuspid valve it is located in the fifth intercostal space so uh, the relative location here it is now clear that the aortic valve aortic valve it is normal auscultatory sound point at the second intercostal space in the right but we can see anatomical location it is third intercostal space this point third intercostal space right left is in this point and not so much important because they all are located behind the sternum but the aortic valve it located right relating to the pulmonary valve then we can see the mitral valve the mitral valve it is auscultatory sound point is in the fifth intercostal space but the mitral valve it is anatomical location is the fourth intercostal space then we can see the tricuspid valve the tricuspid valve it's a normal auscultatory point at the fourth intercostal space and it is on the left side but uh, its anatomical location this is the fifth intercostal space in the right side now let's see in this figure in this figure we can see this is the aortic valve this is the aortic valve normally anatomically located aortic valve and here this is the pulmonary valve and we can see the anatomically located aortic valve it lies on two three this is the third intercostal space on the other hand the mitral and tricuspid they are located below and pulmonary located above and this all valve are located just behind the sternum so here we have to find out identity well, we have to find out the barber that means the auscultatory sound and it is the fourth intercostal space as it is the fourth intercostal space it is the tricuspid valve other such as the mitral valve we know the mitral valve it located in the fifth intercostal space aortic valve it located in the second intercostal space but it is in the uh, right side pulmonary valve it also located in the second intercostal space but in this area a which is the left and right ventricular aneurysm usually the right ventricular aneurysm are not related with the fourth intercostal space so our answer is the tricuspid valve this tricuspid valve is located into the fourth intercostal space thank you all